Hello and welcome to and BB Season 22. There's your obstacles list. And the first runner of the season is going to be Stella Fogarty. She is a derby girl, actually very good at roller derby. If you're not, if you're not familiar with the sport of roller derby, basically a bunch of girls skate around on roller skates and bump into each other. It's actually quite entertaining. Stella clears the first obstacle, the steps. Now she's onto the Bridge of Blades. We've seen this on stage one a few seasons, and she barely gets through it. Now onto the ring toss. New rules now on the ring toss. You do not have to go a required distance. You can dismount at any time, but you do have to dismount from the rings into a small circle. Stella getting a little bit of advice on how to do the ring toss. And will she try any placements? She did do a few placements last season, uh, but still ended up failing in the city finals. Looks like she's just going to get some swing off the chair. It looks like she's probably going to go for it. Will she make it from no placements at all? No, she doesn't. She goes down. Next up is Rarvin. She has only cleared the first obstacle once. That was back in Season 19, which is the last time she competed. She had the chance to compete in Season 20, but was injured. And flies through the Bridge of Blades. Rarvin off to a good start, but now upper body. We've never really seen Rarvin on an upper body obstacle. Who knows? How is her upper body? It's like she's got some circular momentum here on the ring toss. And she goes straight down. Rarvin down on the ring toss. Next up is Lucy Butstein. She is a grizzled veteran of this sport. Competed pretty much every single season since season 6, I believe. I believe that was when she started, when she finished the city finals. She actually finished city finals last season, too. So, coming off, making it all the way to the final obstacle of stage 2 last season. Three buzzers in a row last season. Now, she's having a good time here on this course. Trying to become the first to clear the ring toss. And she turns around. Actually, two hands on the same ring. Is she going to try to make this dismount backwards? Look at this. Lucy Buston going to try to go to the backwards dismount. And she makes it. Straight into that rope. Now into the balance hop school ledge walk. We've seen this the last two seasons. But this one's even harder since it now has three ledges. Lucy flying. Two of those are actually inclined. And she barely clears the ledge walk. Now into the ball swing. This knocked her out a few times. Back in uh, seasons 16 and 17 and 18. But Lucy hopefully can get through it this time. Smaller cannonballs. But you also have that all that weight coming down from right here. Lucy can't actually make the dismount. She did it in practice. and But she goes straight down this time down on the ball swing. Next up is Bilbo 2K. He is very bad at the Mario Kart. We were playing Mario Kart on the Wii after filming. And uh, Bilbo not the greatest. But he flies through the Bridge of Blades, and now the ring toss. He's going to jump for it, and he makes it! You can use your hands on the wood, which is exactly what he did. His hand did not touch that grass. Uh, I believe we're looking at that right now, and it is confirmed his hands did not touch that grass. He flies through the ledge walk. What a save by Bilbo. Barely saves it. Almost hit the ground very hard on the ledge walk. And now onto the ball swing, and he's using the ropes. Has to use those cannonballs, though, even though they're small. And he goes straight down on the ball swing. Bilbo 2K makes it to the fifth off goal and hits the buzzer anyway. Next up is Larry Bustine. He's beat Tyler Gillette twice, so, I mean, he's, uh, he's okay, maybe. Flies through the steps and the Bridge of Blades, fastest through the Bridge of Blades, it seems like. Well, big thing for the Bustine family. Coming up next is Daddy Bustine. So, could all the Buttsteins compete for the first time? I mean, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be pretty interesting. Lucy made it to the fifth obstacle. Larry cruising through the fourth right now, though he's losing his balance. Barely saves it and gets through. Now he is on to the ball swing. A little sketchy camera work. That is not unexpected. Happens a lot. Larry is might be trying to reach out straight for the second ball. No, he doesn't, but he skips it. And now just the dismount remains, and Larry Butstein is our first finisher. Larry Butstein breaks through in a course that was looking very tough. Next up is Daddy Butstein. He is a rookie. I mean, he did compete back in season, I believe, three. But that was the only time he has competed. Actually made it to stage three. That was not in the modern era, so it doesn't really count now. And look at that! He does dismount from the rings! <laughs> Barely makes it through the ring toss. Gotta get off that brick, though. Not allowed to use the brick. Gotta get on that ledge, and he does. But look at this. Trying to show off his balance skills. He's a big dude. And he gets through the ledge walk. 
and now one obstacle away, Daddy Budstein could get through the qualifying course. And he does! Daddy Budstein! And he actually has the fastest time! So here's your leaderboard. Daddy Budstein, Larry Budstein, Bilbo2K, and Lucy Budstein will all be moving on to the city finals. Like, subscribe for more. See y'all later.